This weekend's Burris Falls Nationals race is the final event ever at the Dumplin Valley Raceway in Kodak. The owner tells 10 News tells Fox 43 the land they were leasing was sold to a storage facility company, forcing him to close their track for good. Reporter Grace King caught up with some of the racers as they shared memories on the track one final time. For decades, the sounds of go-karting filled Dumplin Valley Raceway, and Barrett Terry has been there from the very beginning. We, uh, we actually started racing up here uh, right after the racetrack opened. He's raced across the country. Daytona, WK National Championships and stuff all over the place. But to Terry, Dumplin Valley is home. That's where I met my wife. A lot of good friends, good people, people that I wouldn't have met if it wasn't for this. The people who work and race here are what make Dumplin Valley so special. We really enjoyed all the people that we've had and uh, the uh, fellowship, I mean, watching the kids grow up. A lot of great people have come through here. It's been a big deal. Lots of families have come together here, and that's the biggest thing. Memories like those will help Dumplin Valley's legacy live on. It's been a great racetrack. Everybody's really sad that it's closing down. Sad about the raceway, but mainly about people. Of course, we will race with these people at other racetracks and stuff and uh, and see them then, but it's uh, it, it's still going to be different, like I said, for not being at Dumplin' Valley and, and uh, getting to be with those people here. So Here at Dumplin' Valley, a place Steve Horner hopes will be remembered by just four simple words. <laughs> Best racetrack ever. In Kodak, Grace King.